Hi, welcome again. In this video, we're going to look at how to do a performance profiler using a tool called RenderDoc. So basically here we can see how my view is rendered from start to end. Everything is detailed here. So let's let's see how we can get this and, and try to understand a lot of these numbers. And um, yeah, first you need to install a tool called RenderDoc. Uh, you can get it freely uh, from this website. But unfortunately, this is only available on Linux and Windows only. Yep, uh, and that's all you have to install. Then go to your project and let's install a RenderDoc plugin. You can easily do that by settings, plugins, and search for RenderDoc. So I, I already enabled that. So just click this button. Then it will ask you to restart the engine and yeah, just, just proceed with that. After you have done that, you'll see this the render doc icon appears on your viewport. So let's say I want to see how how Unreal Engine renders this scene. Quite easy. I can simply click this icon. Then it will open the render doc UI like this. So here we can see the screen we captured. All right. Then uh, just double click this icon, and then it will load some stats to the left side. Just click the the time the clock symbol on the toolbar then it will show the time it took to render this each step and i can go to the texture weaver all right now let's find out which is taking this amount of time so i can expand like this and i think it's something around hmm yeah this one mobile base pass so i can expand this one go through that one and see how it render there in my game so you can see the times it took and then yeah you can uh, find out which are the things you need to fix and then simply improve by looking at this and also another thing we need to look at is for post processing here you can see now bloom is taking quite a lot of time so if i can uh, take it take it out bloom yeah and it will save some time on my game right uh, I'm, I'm not gonna expand all these things and, and show you how to how to understand these things but if you want to do that uh, and there's a really good course on unreal engine learning platform just search for this uh, in deep look at real-time rendering and it's just uh, like four four hours long but really dense content and just just try to go with that uh, and then you can easily understand everything available here in the render doc and and more other stuff all right that's it for today and in the next video we are trying to profile actual mobile app running on the android device and that will show us the exact timing and then we can understand what we need to fix and then we can apply some uh, tweaks all right um see you soon with something cool